Hi, in a previous video I showed you how to create your own PayPal button. If you haven't already got an account with PayPal, you need to sign up here for free. Otherwise, just go straight in to your account and you'll be directed to your summary page. So you need to go here to profile and then profile and settings. And on the left here, you have my selling tools. Click onto that and the very first piece of information is your PayPal buttons and over on the right, you, some you might have to scroll over, but over here on the right you have update and you will be given here an item name and on the right hand side action buttons. You want to donate one, so we have to go and click on action and perhaps create a new button. And we want to choose a certain button type that suits what we're going to do, which is donations. And you type in whatever you have to put in here, whether it's your organization or something like um, what we had done earlier on, which is to buy a coffee. So buy a coffee for me with thanks. You don't have to put in a donation ID. This is what it's going to look like. You might want to change your currency. We'll leave it at the dollar. And I'm going to customize the text based on the button that we had created in Canva. So I'm going to use my own button. Now you're given a URL in which you have to put in and the button we have that we downloaded is a JPEG file and sometimes this causes problems. So what we're going to have to do is from here, I'm going to go into my own WordPress site and I'm going to upload the image into my media file and that will give me a URL. So here's my WordPress dashboard and I'm going to click on media, add new and select the file that I had created in the previous video. And here's the URL that it, WordPress has given me for this file. So I'm just going to copy that back into PayPal and I'll paste it in here. Now we're not given a customer's view for some reason, but that's okay. I'm going to connect this up to that button that I just created. I can use my primary email address. That's fine. Save my button at PayPal. That's okay. And I think I'm okay with that. I'm just going to create the button. We are given the code which we're not going to use because that's going to give you a blank buyer's view. And that code is typically only used if you stick with PayPal's own donate button. So what we're going to click here, strangely enough, is email. And we have now our own unique URL in which this will redirect visitors who click onto your button to PayPal. So I'm going to copy this, go back to my WordPress site. And then I'm going to put this image somewhere onto one of my pages. Just say on the about page, for example. And I'll stick it in here. So add media. I've already uploaded my file, so it should be in my media library. Insert it into page. And once I click that and you have this highlighted box around your image, I'm going to click on this insert or edit link. And from what I copied from PayPal, I'm going to paste it right here. And I'm going to open the link in a new tab. When that's done, I'll update it. I'll close out my WordPress site and we see how it works. Okay, so we have put the image in my about page. This is a previous one, but the one I put in was right here. Clicking onto this should direct me to my to PayPal. And there we have it. So this is what a visitor would see. Buy a coffee for me with thanks. You put in your donation amounts, we say three bucks. And you need to log in and proceeds to PayPal and that will be deposited into your account from your visitor. Thanks for watching. I hope you learned a bit from this video. 
and if you want to give me a like or even subscribe to my channel